I'm Franco and I'm Lucia and we're going to be reviewing a microneroid robot from my canner. This is how a box would kind of look. We have already assembled it. I had help from my dad. Um, it was um, quite fun to build but it was a few little mistakes they made. They didn't product but it still made didn't affect how fun or not fun it was. It's still doable and still fun. This is how it looks. We're going to show you all the features of this robot. So first, we'll go to the 8-ball setting. You can ask it questions, yes or no questions, and it will answer. Do you like robots? Yes. <laughs> Are you a robot? <laughs> Are you smart? No. Okay, let's go to the next setting. Next ah, is G. It's, no, it's GJ. DJ. 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 You can press the um, buttons on the top to change the little song he does. His eyes change colors, as you can see. That's DJ mode. Next is, what is the next mode? Next is autonomous mode. Apparently the robot has a mind of its own when it does this, has this mode. Oh, what can I show us one of the skills? Yeah, that was fun. See how it moves? Wheels don't move. It's just robots, so we we'll just make it move. Does silly noises. I think I, I know it didn't. Yeah, it doesn't like that. And it's also got um, wheels. Yeah, they don't move. Well, they can't move. Really right, and you can record your voice. Hello. Hello. See? Let me check. You can't leave it on, or is it just wander off? <laughs> Hello, I'm a robot. Hello, I'm a robot. <laughs> <laughs> to turn it off, you just do sleepy mode. Sleepy mode just turns it off. The kit provides everything you need to build this. This is a wrench, and this is an island wrench. You got some instructions here to build it and how to actually walk it too. You can program it. But it's hard, right? It's easy to program and download. It's just hard. Downloaded the programming program on the co our computer. It is pretty easy to program. It is fun. You, you can. 
make the eyes flash whatever color you want you can uh, make it say things it even allows you to um, when you're programming it allows you to um, play through and see what it does right so if you have a tiny table like us probably you can um, be sure it doesn't fall off oh yeah like programming it right we saved and downloaded did what we made but we can't figure out how to get robo the robot to do it and it's not in for instructions when our dad gets home he's gonna help us since our mom doesn't know what to do with computers needs four triple a batteries it's worth it even if you cannot use the computer program because everything we show you is already ready to go Lucia, would you like to go first? All right. From 1 to 10, I would give this product... Hmm. I see. I would do... 8. Wait, no. 9. I really like it. Like, you don't, you don't have to actually program it for, to, for it to be, like, really good. And I do, like like the look as well colors no instructions yeah we had some problems with that but that's why I didn't give it a 10 but look it's not a robot so you can get to oh yeah similar we got we got ACE ace. Ace. we got ACE if you get more from one they interact with each other okay. my review is I give it a nine because I think it's fun. It looks awesome and it's fun to build. It would get get a ten, but in fact, it's hard. You you can't really um, get it to um, do what I program to. It doesn't get the ten, but it deserves a nine because it's awesome. Are we done with a video? Yes. All right. That said, that's it. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you later. Do you say bye too? Yep. All right.